All right, we seem to be live. Uh, and this is the first time I've been on the server since it was down for a while. Um, I'm pretty sure I did not leave a chest in the middle of my floor. Wow. Not even over on the side? At least Jack and I left this one over on the side. What is this? I've kept an eye on you, dipshits. Oz is spineless. Stars is mindless. August is hopeless. What? What? August is hopeless. You, you're the only worthwhile one. You and I are the only ones who might be able to get out of this. Who might be able to take him down. Him? Who's him? So prove it. Negative 228, 101, 94. Look for the brain dead bruise. Treasure awaits. What the f- What? Treasure. What? What? Well, might as well go check it out, I guess. Let's call that plenty. Let's see. Oh, what were those coordinates again? Hang on. Negative 228.94. Okay, so like broadly in that direction. Is it night? Hang on. Let me just. the video and audio are out of sync. Why are the video and audio out of sync? That's not fair. <laughs> I don't want to troubleshoot. I'm excited for the, the dungeon. I haven't even seen the dungeon yet. I'm not seeing anything I can fix. Oh, you know what? I never put subtitles on on this version. There we go. It's like, why does this feel subtly off? Uh, we switched, uh, launchers or something and had added a bunch of mods for lore reasons. Uh, looks good to me? Okay. Okay. Uh. 
Uh, so still kind of this direction. Let's try this again. Hi. Uh, can you tell I'm barely awake? <laughs> Everyone has to be nice to me. It's my birthday ne this coming week. And this is what I get for not streaming for like nine days. I think it's been longer than that since my last Haven stream. Alright, hello friends. I'm doing it right this time. Didn't anyone ever tell you it's rude to blow up on people? Why is there a chicken? Okay. It was negative uh, 228, right? Uh, so maybe that island over there? That looks plausibly at the right coordinates. I'm not a great judge of distance and I'm not a great navigator. Common misconception, it's actually polite to blow up on people, hope this helps. All right, all right, I, I may have been wrong. Understandable. no way I'm making that. I may not be a great navigator, but I know how some things work. Alright, let's see. Two... Twenty-eight. And then that way. Okay, yeah, I think it is that island. Also, even if it were rude, maybe rude is okay. Maybe being rude is okay sometimes if you have a good reason. Alright. Nah, I'm just gonna bridge. It's fine. There's a taller section over there. I'll live. Uh... Let me just... Yeah, that should get me across. If not, I can go back to the oak farm. Uh, I hope you're enjoying this riveting content. Uh, it is not my fault that I can't get down there. Someday I will learn how to speed bridge, but that's not today. <laughs> Bridging stream, woo. <laughs> I'm doing my best. I'm 
Man, did you know there's like 50 different kinds of speed bridging with all sorts of like fancy names and stuff? No, I think learning to speed bridge right now when you are over void is a great idea. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> We're almost there, I think. I mean, we're over the right island. Speed Bridge, a game second only to Speed Canasta. <laughs> yeah. I never did. Well, technically I did learn how to play Bridge and then I completely forgot it. Okay, how are we doing? Okay, what were those y coordinates? 101. Uh, okay, so that's down a bit. Eh, well, this is makeable anyway. I've got food. Wow, that is not great. A nice flag. So, like, around here. I'm not gonna murder a wandering trader. How am I gonna get the llamas home? Man, I should have brought a bed so that I could sleep through the night. I'm trying to find the entrance to this. Is it, like, through this waterfall? That's, like, not quite right. Hang on. You can murder the llamas too. Why would I murder the llamas too? I don't think it's through here. Yeah, it's somewhere around here. I guess there's a light here. Okay, yeah. For the bruise what was it brain dead bruise what is a brain dead bruise it's a brain dead bruise bit. Is that coral? That's coral. This is what I get for not doing ocean exploration ever. I can set a spawn and sleep the night away. Dead brain coral. Okay. Or oh, I guess I can't sleep the night awake. Multiple people are on. Hi, I'm smart. Here's a lectern. Okay. So, here's how this is going to work. This is a test. Five rooms, five trials. If you're chicken shit, you can walk through here right to the end, snatch the reward. But I'm watching. 
If you skip a test, you fail. If you cheat the rules, you fail. If you back out, you fail. I'm not going to piss away my remaining time with failures. If you can't swing this, then we're done. No more help, no more gifts. You're on your own and you'll deserve it. But if you make it, then I'll give you everything you need to take down the man who brought us all here. Rules are simple. Read the books, follow instructions. One room at a time. Impress me. Why is there an empty chest here? Are there stone blocks here? Okay. Okay, I can do this. It's like answers and stuff. Why are there slime blocks? What is... Puzzle Pog. Okay. Uh, chat, I have actually never seen this dungeon before. I trekked out here last night just to make sure I was going in the right direction because I didn't want to spend like seven hours trying to figure out where I was going. So I am bad at navigation, but that was as far as I got. I just made sure that I like knew where the coordinates were. Let's figure this out. Man, we're going all in on the coral theme, huh? This test is simple. It's a trial of the heart. Behind you is a roaming merchant. He's no one important, just a wandering shitbag looking for a quick deal. Not a saint, but not a sinner. But it doesn't matter who gets hurt, not to the enemy. So it shouldn't matter to us either. Break the glass, force him in the lava, let him burn to nothing. Show me you can go the distance, that your heart can handle a little meaningless cruelty. We're really going all in on the coral, huh? Break the... Oh, the wandering trader is in there and invisible because it's night. Okay. That's inconvenient. I would like to be able to see what I'm doing, actually. Uh, hang on. There we go. This source seems reliable and worth befriending. Well, okay, yeah, okay. Let's see. Man, I have to specifically let him burn. What happens if I accidentally kill him trying to get him in there? That's as far as it'll go? Okay. Huh? Sir? Huh? It's a good way to die. Oh, he just straight up walked in there. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what is he named? Oh, shithead. Okay. Dumbass. It's pronounced Shafid. Fair enough. Let me just... Yeah, we're really going in all, all in on the coral thing here. Okay. He didn't have a family, if that helps. This room is a test of speed. There are eight lamps in the ceiling. When you break this lectern and step inside, they'll light up one by one. If you're still in the room when the eighth lamp lights, then we're fucking done here. An iron block is in your way. Using the materials in this room, make a sticky piston to move that shit. Don't keep me waiting. I can't... I can't make sticky pistons. 
I can't make pistons. Did I shut this door behind me? Okay, hang on. The puzzle designer had already killed the traitor's family. So thoughtful. <laughs> it's fine. It's... It's a good, clean way to die. I mean, it, it hurts, obviously, but... You, you know, there's worse ways to die. Okay. Man, and I can't I just cheat around either. I can't break around the walls. I have to break the lectern, huh? Well, there's eight redstone lamps. Sticky piston. I guess this is free slime blocks. <laughs> I'm so glad I didn't break the lectern to read the book uh, like someone else I could mention. <sighs> oh my god. Wait, does, does the book open and shut the door? That's- oh my god! Okay, what do I think is the worst way to die in Minecraft? Um... Can I think about that and come back to it? I'm, I'm not sure. What is the worst way to die in Minecraft? Are those lights blinking? What is... Hmm. Punched by an Enderman because you'll know it only happened because you were rude. Yeah, yeah, that tracks. Where even is the door actually? Block is in your way. I don't see an iron block. I see iron ore. Is it like past that wooden thing maybe? I'm not, hmm. I don't see an iron block is the thing. I see whatever that is. That might contain iron. I. It looks like a job block. Or, I mean, specifically, it looks like maybe one of those job blocks that contains iron, which I can't recognize all of them on site at this point. But... Blast furnace, thank you. Yeah, the glowing ores are from, uh, I don't know. Presumably, uh, my shader pack. I don't have a texture pack on. That's a blast furnace king. Look, I can't make them, so it doesn't matter to me. Ugh. Where's the stupid iron block? I guess it's a block containing iron. Sticky piston. Terrible. Who is this person? Oh, 
Okay, so are we operating under the assumption that that's the iron block? This person could write much clearer instructions. But I can't make a sticky piston. Pistons contain iron. Pistons contain iron. Okay. I have... Hmm. Are blast furnaces... What is the blast resistance of blast furnaces? Because if I fill my inventory and then blow it up, that would also get me past. And I feel like it's maybe less cheating than just, you know, mining around it. What did this one say? It doesn't matter who gets hurt not to the enemy, so it shouldn't matter to us either. And it says this this puzzle, this dungeon, is about following rules. But it's also about... Well, that's fine. I didn't need that. Uh, but it's also about stooping to the level of the enemy. Who is the enemy, anyway? Is this that purple bastard that uh, Stars' book talked about? Brought us here. Uh, we don't know the enemy wouldn't cheat. I don't even have dynamic lighting right now, I think. <laughs> I don't know why I have the torches in my offhand. If you cheat, you fail. I've sworn no oaths to this person. I can just go around. But carefully. Right. Your surprise blocks they sure are
Oh, I forgot about the lights. Well, it's fine. I can get past and hopefully the lights didn't all light up while I was. And it's, it's probably fine. It's probably fine. Okay. Good, now we're getting places. This is a trial of strength. Simple, straightforward. Press the button and kill. Use the terrain if you like. Leave nothing alive. Kill what? Oh, button. Okay, we've got the void over there. Got... isn't very nice. Stone axes do more damage per swing than iron axes. What? That's wild. nothing. Fun, wasn't it? Yeah, you could call it that. Next is the trial of focus. The enemy will lie to you, try to manipulate you, tangle you up in lies and also- oh, false. Falso. <laughs> Typo in the group chat, now you fucked up. Lies and false promises and shitty half-truths. Stay vigilant and stay attentive. Watch your step and don't buy into first impressions. I bet this is a gravity trap. Alright. Falsetto promises. Oh my god. Where did you- what? Man, I almost failed that one. I did not see that spider. Was it just biding its time? Anyway, why should I trust you? <laughs> corner spider living in the spider corner. <laughs> Alright, let me just- Yoink, okay. Don't trust first impressions. Hang on, that was this book, right? Stay vigilant, stay attentive. Okay, looks like we've got stairs going up here and we've got something around this corner. But Corner Spider told me it could offer me my heart's desires. Alright, stay vigilant. It's a maze! I love mazes! Alright. Hang on, let me just... Well, both of these seem to be, you know, brain-dead brews. So, Coral isn't a falling block, is it? I hear lava. Let's see what's up here. Huh. <laughs> 
there's a witch in here. That's different. <laughs> I didn't check out this side. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. That's something. <laughs> so most of the things I would use for like indicators are showing up in multiple paths, which might mean something or it might not. A skeleton, but that just might be. Do I have dynamic lighting on? Hang on. Oh my god, I have dynamic lighting. Uh, today we are learning that your local moth is not the smartest brain in the bruise, or however we're putting this metaphor. Where's the stupid witch? Okay, my next thought is that one of these uh, lovely void exits has glass. Why is there a witch? Is the witch on purpose? Okay, you are a lovely void exit. No glass here. Oh, there's more stairs. I don't even know if stairs are the right way, but like, whoever this is bothered to make, you know, multiple levels, so it's probably fine. What's all this about watch your step? It was just stairs! Probably just don't walk into the void, but the void was so obvious. Okay. Well, color me fucking impressed. You've lived up to the hype, pal. You might be the one to put the last nail in this coffin. But there's one last test. A test of grit. Hmm. This broken, shattered world is the work of the cruelest, most brutal person in history. I've lost everything I loved at his hands. Everyone I loved. But I survived. Because the withering in my muscles was weaker than the grit in my soul. Is isn't isn't there like a quote from um I think it was Fallout New Vegas that that <laughs> It's a cooking test. We're going to make grits. <sighs> You'll need to survive pain greater than anything you can imagine. Prove to you that I, you have the grit. Uh, 
bold of you to assume you can put me through pain greater than I am. I, I can imagine. I am. I. I've been through plenty of pain before. Oh my god, please don't be a wither. I don't want to fight a wither. I have a stone axe. No! Chad is bullying me. I don't... What do you think is pain greater than anything I can imagine? I can imagine a whole lot. I have... Can I fight a wither rose? <laughs> I'm not very good at not breaking blocks, huh? Maybe if I fill my inventory. Is that an iron door at the end? That's an iron door at the end. And those are pressure plates and I bet they're attached. Books should inflict half a heart of damage to you, like 1 in 25 times you open them. At Mojang, please respond to my idea. That's terrible existential terror. That's awful. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sprint. I have How are, how can they even watch me in here? It's... Oh, you know what? I'm absolutely taking these slam blocks. They're my reward. I don't think I can place boats in... Technically, they never told me I couldn't break blocks. Oh, chat, you're so smart. Just uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that probably is not under the spirit of the test, but that was so funny. <laughs> It was really, really, really funny. <laughs> I probably should have suffered pain room, but I wanted to see if that would work. 
you know what? Fine. I'll go. I'll I'll go back to the beginning, and I will go back to angsting, and I will suffer pain room. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, wait, I got approval. I got approval. It's a valid solution. I win. <laughs> have the, the fucking speech from Hellraiser memorized so I could just quote it about the pain room. Oh my! <gasps> I'll be in touch. It was K! It was this K person! Boat is symbolic if we want it to be. You're sad. P you said, you said pain is unnecessary if you have a boat. Yeah, pain is unnecessary if you have a boat. Well, all these guys stack at least. I don't remember the quick grab. I keep meaning to learn it, and then I just don't. Uh, the potions aren't gonna stack though. Pain is unnecessary if and only if you have a literal boat. <laughs> it's like the opposite of the Nun of Swords. Okay. Let me see. <laughs> That's enough splash potions. Or not splash potions. That's enough gold to make Two golden. I can have both villagers. I can have villagers. Oh, and I have so much wheat. I can throw them so much bread. Okay, let's see. That can go, that can go, that can go. I don't need that. I don't need that. Mostly broken axe can go. There, I'm so good at inventory management. A boat is kind of a reverse cup. Same shape, but instead of the water going in it, the water goes under it. Okay, yeah. The one of boats. This is beautiful. I love you guys. Rotation. Oh, I can rotate. <laughs> My favorite thing about this is I think the pressure plates are supposed to connect to those uh, slime blocks and iron bars, uh, but they don't seem to be. <laughs> One of boats, my beloved. Oh. I don't need that. How do I get back down? I never did find the witch in this maze. I feel like it would be worthwhile to get someone to rename that boat to one of boats on an anvil for you. You know what? You know what? That's an awesome idea. I'm gonna get someone to do that. One of boats, my beloved. <laughs> I 
And now we'd get just like an hour of me trying to get out of this maze because I am bad at retracing my steps. Oh, that was the exit, huh? All right. Let me just... I feel like I shouldn't leave these books here. Let me just... Okay, if I leave the books here in this chest, then no one else knows where this is and I can come back and get them later. Uh, and I can get my stuff home safe. Who the f who is K? You just drop them. To no, they're like evidence and stuff. I'm not dropping them to despawn. I'm just gonna come back and get them. I might have regrets. I've still got it. All right. So assuming that K was the same one from the other book we found. Books? Did we find two books with K? Because I found another book, or Jackdaw found another book that one time that was written by someone else but was maybe about the same, you know, smug purple bastard. That's not me, is it? I don't... I, I don't do that kind of stuff. It's not me. Other people can be purple. Yeah, I, I know I'm purple, but I'm, like, cool. And I don't hurt people anymore. I don't think I left my, uh, someone in chat said, Knife Moth, your name does start with a K. I don't think I left myself a puzzle dungeon, though. And I definitely couldn't have made it on my own. Like, that, that was a lot of iron. I could not have made that thing. I would have had to recruit someone else. I have no bastard energy. Thank you, chat. It would be real funny if you had completed a challenge puzzle to show that you were worthy of squaring off against yourself. That is really funny. <laughs> worthy of jumping down one of the... No. Don't be silly. Okay. These guys... 
These guys I want in a more secure location before I start curing them. Let me... Okay, I'm the only one on now, so I can just sleep through the night. Maybe it's your arch nemesis knife lamp. <laughs> okay, that's really funny, actually. Okay. come back and get most of this later. <laughs> My nemesis knife lamp. I can't use these name tags, but they'll be good for trading. <laughs> Alright, let's actually get those books. I don't like leaving loose ends. I don't know. I don't... I don't think I failed the test. I mean, I didn't exactly follow the rules, but... Something tells me I followed the spirit of it. I think I'm going to shy away from some normal murder. It's not even... <laughs> Hell, I didn't even have to work for it. I was all like, how am I going to get this guy to walk into the lava? And then he just sort of walked into it ten times. It was a mercy to let him out, really. I mean, that's faulty logic, but... No, it's, it's, not, it's not faulty logic. If someone wants to die, they should... They should get to die. It's fine. I didn't do anything wrong. He walked into my lava. He walked into my lava ten times. <laughs> That's basically exactly what happened, except it wasn't even my lava, it was Kay's lava, whoever Kay is. Yeah, that was a neat dungeon. Uh... Out of character, out of character. Fucking props to sleep for putting that together. That was great. I 
and he left no one to mourn him. That's usually the hard part. I do kind of wish he'd left llamas, though. I don't know how I'd have gotten them home, but llamas would have been nice. Who does this guy think I am? Someone who hasn't killed? Someone who doesn't know what true pain is like? There are things that scare me more than iron. Without a boat. <laughs> All right, let's see what I can do for you. Okay, the idea here is to close this off and then dig down. Uh, because I can't move the boats over. once they're on, um, whatchamacallit. That's not very nice. I'm about to cure you. You can't treat me like that. Alright. And I don't really know how this works, but I'm gonna pretend like I know how this works, so it's fine. Where did my golden apples go? Did I put them away? Why am I so bad at this?
golden apples don't just disappear from inventories, do they? No, they do not. Yeah. Why did I put them over there? What the heck, me? thing I've ever done actually that's really funny actually <laughs> let's let's try this a different way okay hang on hang on hang on I'm smart I think that got both of them. All right. It better have got. Well, okay. Yeah, that should work. The boat betrayed me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, bye people who are leaving. Uh, I love you guys. I can't believe I'm carrying my zombie villagers! I didn't think I was gonna get to do that! <laughs> Someone who doesn't have a bow. See, that's the great part of not being able to do bucket MLGs, is you just sort of have a boat on you at all times, just in case. Now, mind you, I also can't do boat MLGs, but that's because I'm bad at them, not because, like, I can't. Zombieism is anyway. I mean, it clearly changes people, but it can be killed and, you know, bring back the original unzombie person. A state of mind. How is a state of mind, um, transmittable then? And why is it cured by golden apple? Are they just hangry? Maybe they're just hangry. Maybe I'm thinking too much about things I shouldn't think about. A state of mind is transmittable through communication. So true, bestie. <laughs> We're just reinventing Pontypool. Is it something from the nether? That's an interesting concept. Uh, while, while we're waiting for these guys, uh, Pontypool is actually maybe my favorite horror movie uh, because it's about, it's a zombie movie but the infection is linguistic. Like, there are infected words, and if you hear an infected word, then your language becomes infected. Uh, 
it's a really, really good movie, and it makes, like, <sighs> excellent, excellent use of having, you know, a limited filming space. Almost all of it takes place inside a radio station. Uh, anyway, all of you should watch Monster Pool. There goes one. Ah, uh, like what happens when you get used to Pog being a word. Yeah. You know what? It's exactly like that. We are all conversationalists. Uh, there's also, like, semantic satiation. Okay, hang on. Let me get you... Out of there. Get get on there. Get get. He won't do it. You disappoint me. Oh, is it because there's a ceiling? Hang on. I forgot that villagers have like. Oh. <laughs> Get, get on there, get on there. Okay. Now, according... ZF lied to me, okay. <laughs> Romantic boat trip. Okay, let's see what these guys have actually. Nothing. Right, they're nitwits, they need job blocks. Right, job blocks. Oh yeah, they do must bone. Let me let me throw bread at them. Hey guys, hey guys, you should fuck. Let me just. Uh, and they need beds too. Hang on, I think I have some wool at home. Why do I just have, like, permanent bad luck with mouses? I deserve better than this. Why am I always out of wood? Plenty. Beds and extra seal- right, I forgot about the ceiling clearance, thank you. I really need to make them a better structure, but... What if I go to bed? Man, this has been a really fun stream. I should have made a door too while I was at it. I can go back and make a door. Or actually two trap doors, because villagers can work doors. I don't know how to make a trap door. Hang on. Oh yeah, that's fine. That's just fine. I'm a really fun streamer. Thank you. And then this is just temporary um, until that's not going to. This is just frick. 
Why are you free range? Stop being free range. No. I've made a mistake. <laughs> I've made a mistake. Okay. It's fine. I can recover from this, let me think. Wait, did they come in here? Where did they go? If I lose my villagers after all this, I'm going to be so upset. Ugh, oh, why are they free range? Okay. Can I just do like the, the zombie hardcore door trick on the villagers? Where did they go? Okay. With my luck, they probably left the village and already fell into the void. Wait, there's one. The village has a bell. Someone put a bell here. I know I saw a bell here. Where did it go? Okay, there's the other. Sir, that's my house. Okay, I know I saw a bell. There. They might be out of range. Hello and welcome to Moth doesn't actually know how to play Minecraft. Okay. You. Shh, go in the pit. All right, and then the other one went over here somewhere. Uh, let me break these beds so I can plant them. All right, you. They did not want to move in with me. Hang on, I've got a boat. Let me just, sir. Sir. Uh. Well, he's going in broadly a direction. There uh. we go. Uh. Alright, sir, we are going to go somewhere safer. Or at least ideally we're gonna go somewhere safer in practice you probably will die because I am really bad at this uh, now we're stuck because I did that that's fine that's close enough it's fine okay yeah let's do a pit I think the island is pretty thick around here. I was digging for other purposes at one point. He wants to move in with me. He was standing there looking up the curve. You're very silly. For the record, I considered subscribing when you rung the bell because that is what you do when streamers do that. You're so right. That's exactly what you do when streamers do that. Alright, 
let's get you down here. Sex pit funding too. You guys are horrible, you know that? I love you for it, but you're horrible. There we go. Nice and safe. Um, let's dig over to this guy. Come back. Come back this way. Okay, this still works. I can still add a trap door and it'll be fine. It'll be better. Yeah, okay. And then I can dig down another level or two or three or whatever. Hope you're enjoying this riveting entertainment of me being bad at Minecraft. Okay. Why is he walking my bed? Oh. Well, I didn't place the other beds down. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Why won't this go? I deserve better than this. All right, dumbass. Why doesn't this one work? There we go. There's one. There's two. There's three. Okay. This, this is fine. This is fine. We're fine. Oh, I'm sure where the foot will go. That's confusing. <sighs> All right, beautiful. Pick up the bread, doofuses. Are my ceilings too low? Do I need to put... I think my ceilings might be too low. Uh, 
That's fine. I can I, I can figure this out. I can install higher ceilings. I have the technology. I have the technology. We're fine. We're fine. these villagers <laughs> and if it kills me it's fine i'm gonna do it we're making it happen sorry friend no oh, i should go sleep Okay. Should I do this? And then we're gonna have to tell someone about these guys at some point. Take it. Are they not taking any of it? Bread is the right thing to throw, right? Take it. Why are they just staring at it? I just cured them! No. What if I put down... What if I put down job blocks? Because there are some I can make. Posters make farmers. Yeah, I think I have a composter unless someone took it. I think someone took it. Right. Oh. Let's have a composter then. Make someone a farmer. I don't know. I'm just sort of throwing spaghetti at the wall here, seeing if something works. Come on. There you go. You have a job now. Trade wheat for emeralds. That works. I should go get more wheat and lock you in, actually. I have so much wheat you don't even know.
let me just... That's pretty good, okay. Just click the... I guess Moth traded gluten sensitivity for iron vulnerability. That's kind of what it feels like, honestly, role-playing this. Like, I could do it, but at what cost? No more of that. Okay. Let's see. What other job blocks can I make? And will you take the frickin' bread? Oh my god, he took the frickin' bread! No, he didn't. I still have the same amount of bread I started with. I hate this. Seep says, would you stop interrupting them when they're trying to have makeouts? These farmers have things to do, namely each other. No, they don't, because they have no bread. I need them to breathe. They need to take the breed bread. Am I, am I doing something wrong? I'm pretty sure at, at this point it's just, you, you know, the, the beds and the bread and the... I don't know why I did that. I'm frustrated. What other job blocks exist? Hang on. Just, just give me the job blocks. Job site blocks. get a cartographer that probably does nothing. I have no clue what even generates on floating island worlds. Can't make a brewing stand. Can make a barrel, but I don't have, you know, fish to sell. Fletching table would be useful. Cauldron I can't make. Lectern I can make. Librarians aren't super useful for me, but they might be useful for other people. Uh, Loon, what do shepherds even do? Okay, Fletchers are arrows and stuff, okay. Flint and planks. I have a bunch of lecterns. Uh, but again, librarians aren't super useful for me in the first place. What do shepherds do? see that. That's my spreadsheet of my videos. Alright. I can... I could bring a lectern down here. Why did I close that? I closed that and, like, immediately forgot what I can make. Oh, right, Fletcher table. I have flint, I have planks. Fletcher table. Yes. That's fine, probably. Okay, Fletcher table. 
Go get a job. You're employed. Hang on, what if I bring this back? I don't know what level Fletcher's sell arrows at. Come on. Okay. And I'm given... Emerald for an arrow is a novice one. Okay, so I do want to reset that. for me. Okay, yes, arrow trade. Let me lock you in quick. Oh my god, finally a source of arrows! Oh my god, okay. Now you're both employed, and that's the only thing I could think of that, like, might affect this. Have the frickin' bread. Take it! Take it! I'm gonna cry! Yeah, someone did suggest that their inventories might be full, but like, full of what? I just cured them! Uh, oh, this is the trading one that the villagers want. Okay. Breeding. Beds with at least two empty blocks above them. Job sites are not required. I thought they weren't required. Villagers breed as long as there are unclaimed beds. Two blocks of clearance. I think these guys have two blocks of clearance. Yeah, that's plenty. That's plenty. Okay, hang on. I think I have some beetroot. I can try throwing beetroot instead. If mob griefing is fo mob griefing is totally on, uh, we Aster wanted to turn it off and we rioted. seeds somewhere around here in this chest yeah uh so i can just put a little farm down there and try and get i don't know a beet farm going i think i have some potatoes too but i'm not sure where i put them yeah i can get a little potato farm or something so i've got that farmer down there I do have a hoe. <laughs> oh no. Who, who do I have to bully into sleeping? Oh, yes, okay. I'm so good at this game. Oh, 
you know escape. That's probably fine. Okay. Where did my head go? Beds might need a space between them. I can try that. Certainly try it. I just glitched the bed out of existence. What? Did you guys see that? What? That was weird. That, that, that was weird, right guys? That was weird. This is, this is, this is fine, this is fine. We're fine. It's fine. Frick, I don't have water. Tell Oz about the thing, I guess. It shouldn't show anyone the books. They don't have to breed instantaneously, they just gotta pick up the food so that they can at some point breed. Four, five, six. 
I could try placing a torch bed in case the pattern is just screwed. I think the game just hates me. Actually, a thing for villager breeding uh, several editions ago. Uh, so, like, I used to play 112 a lot with my family, and they do need doors to breed there, which is how you get things like fuck corridors. a better way in and out of here. I get carrots. Okay, beside the point. Okay, one more bed in case the pathing is screwy. Growing him? Okay, hello. That's wrong. Oh, wait, okay. Oh, I'm on. Hello. Uh. Okay. I didn't think I was going to be talking to people, so I'm I on. didn't set up yeah. stupid overlay. You want to go into VC2? Oh, wait, just pop in there. Why are you guys super quiet? Okay. Okay. Oz, can you hear me? Hello, 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 hello. Hi, I uh, I came running. Why do you need a water bucket? Uh, well, come down here. Oh, okay. Okay. Hang on, let me just. Yeah. Oh. Why are they just congregating? I hate these guys. So you've been busy. I've been busy. <laughs> Look at them. Uh, but wow. they, they won't breed, and I'm not sure why, so I wanted to establish a farm maybe over here with, you know, root vegetables. Sure. Crap. Um, so... I have uh, the water, so we were wait, to place wait, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, so I need water in there. Yes. Beautiful. Any more? Uh, that should be fine. Okay. Well, that's me just... neat. Okay. So you have, you have villagers now. Look at them. I have villagers now. <laughs> Chat, I have no clue how the sound quality is. Sorry. <laughs> uh, it should be... Let me know if I need to turn up anything. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I've just... I've been... Potatoes. Oh. Yes. I've been messing with uh, my volume and stuff all week because I've been working on that uh, solstice lore for mm -hmm. Klausum. Which has nothing to do with anything here, but um... <laughs> That's fair. Um, 
do you need more of my assistance? I was No, I think that's I'm fine, in... but um, you know, you can come trade with these guys anytime. Thank you. That's really nice. Thank you. There you go. Now we can jump. Yeah. Okay. That's really nice. All what right. Is up with that? I I'm going to go. We're yeah, go to ahead. Get, Just um, we're Thank to you. Thank you. Thank Gerald. you. Of course. Trying to, just, trying to make Gerald move. It's really hard. I don't know if you've ever tried to move a spider before. Yeah, I saw you die there. Yeah, <laughs> it happens. It does you know? happen. All right. In the name of roommates. All right. Good luck with that. Villagers. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Place another bed in case the pathing is weird. I can do that. It's fine. Everything's fine. This should not be as hard and complicated as it is. I don't know what's going on here. That'll be all fast traveling. I, I need a less scuffed entrance to this place. All right. I think I'm going to be done stream for now. Uh, I should be doing other things that are not, you know, trying in vain to get these villagers to breed. Uh, so I'm gonna go now. Thank you everyone for coming to the stream. This was very, very fun. I'm so glad that I finally got to show this off and see the dungeon. All right, bye.